Who knows the answer? 90s trivia. Flip phones and VHSs. All right, that was, that was an easy one. That was easy. What about... Oh, uh... Who knew about sprinters? One of you was like a sprinter expert. What is Boy Meets World? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Let's get political. Let's get taboo. Oh, the low latency is already working. Yeah. We're always we're always improving. Waco, that's a good one. This is a cool cool stuff in here. Let's let's see. Let's get real weird with it. Who directed Bowfinger? Who cares? That's boomer shit. What Alanis Morissette album sold over 33 million copies? Uh, she's a good singer. Um, Honestly, she's not bad. Yeah. Jagged Little Pill? You nailed it, dude. Oh, man. We are, we are so latent or we are not we are so not latent oh oh transition transition everyone panic we have transis transitioned yeah i did fix it didn't i but you know what i believe it comes at a at a price i think we might we might have to stutter a little more with like if my internet hiccups you're gonna notice Whereas before, it would, like, just eat the buffer, you know? But that's okay. It is worth it. You're right. It's a little more engaging. A little more... Well, it's a lot more engaging, let's be honest. In fact, let's really put it to the test. Should, shouldn't we? Shouldn't we, like, really... Let's really see what's up. Let's get in the nitty-gritty. <laughs> Wicked shirt? Oh yeah, dude. Muadib. Okay, how many players do we have? Muadib. We got Muadib. Lisan Al Galib. Or whatever. <laughs> Alright, how many Thanks. Tell us your name and a little bit about What's my name? Well, you know, as much as you can fit into that little box. Uh Finally. We can name Let's women. Let's play. Uh, none of my lights are on. Lisan Al Galib. Ga <laughs> Let's take a look at your first question. This is the one I really need. This is the one. There we go. Someone who takes a long time to get to the point is often asked to cut the salami. No, that's the cheese. That's easy. You seem sure See, look at how quick your your answers come up. This is you are correct. We're in a new a new world. Let me get some more volume here. This is a new lifestyle. Stream saved. A hundred dollars in the bank. We can we can afford three drinks at the okay, Cheesecake you're Factory. Running. Hey, who am I kidding? You've still got 14 questions to go. Let's get a move on. Let's get a move on, Regis. Wow, so 90s. It's almost like a bowling uh, graphic, like when you get a spare. According to a well-known expression, a wealthy person is said to live high off the honey, high off the hog, high off the hog. H. Hurry, you have to make a choice now or use a lifeline. H isn't an option. Make a choice now or use a I mean, are we going hog? That's the only. All right, we're going hog. Cur, cur with the hog. Cur with the hog. 
I feel like it wouldn't be asking me this if it was right. You're taking your chances on answer B. You are correct. Ooh. Muadib. <laughs> All day, people, all, all day I'm walking around work, I'm going, Let's see if you can make it three for three. The Spice Fields of Arrakis. He goes by Muadib. He calls himself the Little Desert Mouse. According to a common piece of advice, don't take any wooden nickels. I, wa I don't want any of this to be wooden. We got A's in chat. I know, when he came up, when Christopher Walken popped up, I was like, I mean, I'm not mad about it, but I just was not expecting this. <laughs> so you're thinking answer a, it, it did a little bit break the fourth wall for me for just a second. He did he did great. I was all right with it. It was totally fine. But uh, it was it was slightly jarring. It, it, was, it was a casting I did not see coming at all. My cat is Lisa Al Gaib. That's awesome. That's an awesome idea. I might, I might steal that from my next one. Muadib. <laughs> I can't stop saying. I've been saying it all day. According to a 1970s ad campaign, America loves baseball, hot dogs, apple pie, and guns. But Chevrolet. Is that the okay, oh, okay it's an ad campaign time. okay a choice or hit l to use a lifeline yeah i mean that's the most final like who's gonna make an like an alka-seltzer ad campaign doesn't even make sense pepsodent for answer c fine and you're right him doing other type casted shit but in dune universe Interesting. Okay. This is the like if he was just a random soldier and he's like, for one thousand dollars. <laughs> Listen, guy, you're talking to me all wrong. <laughs> he's yelling at. He's yelling at. Um, I don't even know the names of like anything. I'm so like not a Dune guy. This is like my my introduction to Dune is these movies. The name of which of these outerwear garments is also a verb meaning to eat greedily, to scarf. Yeah, we're scarfing. We're scarfing at the cheesecake, bro. We're scarfing, bro. I have no doubt that that's the way to go. All right, looking good here. That's one thousand dollars. Want to double it? Next one is worth two thousand. Thousand bucks. We got three tables at cheesecake. Virtual crimes. Welcome in, Andrew Dolson. JW, Avoid Ralph, Keith, Kerr, Celestial. Welcome in, Jabronis. How many letters represent all the modern Roman numerals? I don't even know what that means. I'm hovering my finger over the L key. Kerr's hitting me with a C. Make a choice or hit L to use. But I'm not confident because this is just it just doesn't make any sense to me. I can't even really read the question. Well a lifeline should do the trick. I kinda wanna pop a lifey. Well a lifeline should do the trick here. Which one do you want? Not gonna pick a lifeline. Okay. Oh, oh wait, I I meant to uh, Wanna go ahead and make that your final answer? We have th we have split answers. Okay, 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 and right, well, I'll give you ten more seconds to think about it. C. You're thinking answer C. Well, all right. <laughs> and you're right. Oh. Oh, if if it wasn't for you listing them out, I would have I would have Hey, that's six questions in a row. Would have let it go. It would have flown away, away in the wind. <laughs> Alright, two thousand bucks we have between three and five tables at the cheesecake, depending on how crazy we get. What is a rapscallion? That is a mis mischievous person. I think that's a mischievous person. Mischievous. Is it mischievous or mischievous? Hurry! You yeah, I'm going A on that. That seems that seems pretty 
Pretty shoe in. That seems pretty easy peasy. You're selecting answer A. I like to think there's like actually a guy in the yes, audience with like it. a drum. When it's like getting intense. He's just he's like at the top. There's one spotlight on him and his chin's up. We're almost halfway to you becoming a millionaire. But there are tough ones ahead. But take a look at this now for eight thousand dollars. For eight thou wow. I consider myself a jabroni air I ate thou wow. I'm cool with that. Which of these skaters does not share a land skaters, wow. Which of these states does not share a land border with Michigan? I have absolutely no idea. This is a uh, area of the country I do not think about. Hurry, you have to make a choice now or use a life. Open road is hitting me you with the oh hi. Use a lifeline. I'm gonna go with it. Or this is all riding on open road. We are from the northeast. I have no idea <laughs> what any of this is. Wait, Keith is saying B. Hey, it seems like you're not so sure. I'll give you ten more seconds to think about it. We don't know. Is what is what we're saying. Three different an all right, I'm going Andrew, because that's the most recent answer. You, like you answer most likely Googled it. No, no, oh. not the right answer. Here's the answer we were looking for. You're out. No more no more answers from Andrew. <laughs> You're out. Hey, you want a thousand bucks? For a thousand bucks. Most people, when I ask the question, we're we're not even getting tables, honestly. Let's just go to the bar. We'll get a couple cakes and beers. That's about all we can do. It's about all we can afford. We're going to Denny's for a thousand bucks. Bro, I used to go to Denny's at like 3 a.m. all the time. Do we? I want to do one more. I just feel like we we can do this now that we have this latency okay, issue solved. We we'll do one more, then we'll get to the Deans, then we'll get to the Resident Evil. Hey, how about giving me your name? Yeah, Google's actually getting worse these days. Um, I don't. I can't think Would of you one. Let us know your name now. I can't think of a woman. Let's get to it. Let's play. Oh, I should have done. Ah, damn. <laughs> Missed opportunity. Now for question number one. Which of these names is most commonly used for a portable notebook sized computer? I'm being very careful. Answer C. Well, all right. That's right. Ah, oh, yes. I must pull my turnkey out of my turnkey bag. You've got the first one of the bag. Let's see your $200 question. Here it comes. <laughs> Same graphic every time. According to a popular saying, those facing the consequences of their actions are paying the piper. Paying the tax man, that could also be the the answer, to be honest with you. You are so right. Those could be, your consequences could be financial. A real, real human genius. And a long way to go. You've got $200 and a long way to go. You've got $200. Why does this happen? A long way to go. Like, once is enough, Regis. I get, I get your point. It's very aggressive. When a movie director wants to be shooting, he traditionally yells, lights, camera, action. The first, the first three are such shoe-ins. So easy. Too easy. Got it. I need a little more excitement. Nice one. You're doing great, really. Now take a peek at your $500 question. Here we go. For 500 bucks, for about 10 drinks, <laughs> a cheesecake, beans. According to the title of a 1970 movie, on a clear day, you can. Oh, 
I don't know. Who's a boomer? Let's get some boomer in the chat. Okay, On a clear right day, you can see forever. Or hit L to use a lifeline. I mean, I'll take the non-boomer advice. Final answer? That's all we got, you know? Yeah, let's just do it. So, you're gonna stick with answer A. You are so right. Well, you're at $500 right now. Answer the next question right, and you'll end the game with at least 1,000 bucks. Here it is. Where on the human body is the elbow located? Wow. That's, that's crazy. That's really a crazy question to ask. I can't, I kind of can't believe that. <laughs> the best choice that's a crazy question absolutely right Ortega hey that's one grand for your effort so far your next question worth twice that much two thousand bucks we're getting the whole case of cheesecake Pro maybe not that's less expensive which of these movies is not primarily set on a submarine Apocalypse Now, right? I don't know what DOS boot is. I actually don't know what any of these are, but I think Apocalypse Now is not on a submarine. Okay, you're running out of time. Make a choice or hit L to use a lifeline. Is that your final answer? You think D is right, okay. When you're right, you're right. When you're beans, you're beans. Six down, nine to go. <laughs> how many how many tabs does it take to Google Apocalypse Now in medical terms? Fear of open spaces is called agoraphobia. I think I'm confident. Yeah. The rest of those, I know right, kind of what they are. Looks good. And you're right. Well, that's $4,000, and now here's a chance to make it $8,000. Take a look at this one. <laughs> what? According to the exact title of Stanley Kramer's 1963 film, <laughs> what kind of world is it? It's a mad world. Y'all remember that Gears commercial, bro? That was emotional. Hurry. It's a mad, it's mad, now. mad use world. Four? You have to make a choice now or use a life. I mean, Kerr's hitting that Google foo. I can't, I feel like I can't. Final? I feel like four is arrhythmic. What is this game on? Bro, no, I pirated no, this a from way to go. the <laughs> internet archive. That's where I get all these old games. You can just download old games on there. Like people just copy CD-ROMs. Hey, yo, one yeah, the way back. Uh, no, it's not the way back. It's just the normal Let's internet archive. I, if, unless that's the same thing. I'm actually, I'm new to this archive business. In the Earth's oceans, what is the most abundant chemical ion? Probably sodium, right? Or is that a red herring? It could be calcium. Could be a lot of fish bones. Right. You have to make a choice now or use a lifeline. My guess is C right. for sure. You have to make a choice now or use a lifeline. Should I just go for it? Is that your final answer? <laughs> 
Keith's with me on this, so I'm just gonna go for it. You think Ansa C can keep you in the game? Yeah. Let's see. No, that's not it. Let's take a look at the correct answer. See, something. I felt a little synapsis saying red herring, red herring. That's a respectable score, but come on. That's all right. We're one day we'll be millionaires, but today is not the day. Apparently, sodium chloride. Oh, interesting. So far, Mia Khalifa, Abella Daniels, Lana Rhodes. Those are the names you want to use. Yeah. Until next time. This game, like, takes over your computer. Like, you can't do anything else. And as soon as I... I'm, like, almost nervous to close it. Because it... All the screens go black. It's one of those games. It's one of those programs. Everything goes black, and you're like, wait a minute. Is it all gone? But it comes back. Let's do the Deans, bro. I don't know why this camera is not... Oh, I cropped this so that I could play, so that I could be a nunchuck guy. That's why. That's why this looks stupid. I was being a nunchuck guy. So I want to make it like this, and then like this. Yeah. There we go. Or something. Something like that. Yeah, there we go. Cool, man. These are Brennan's million hairs. And, uh... Maybe there's a woman we can think of while we're at it. No, those are all underneath. Never mind. Millionaires. Lisa and El Gaib will have his day. Brennan sent these in his insane box. These are wild bristling sardines from Canada. Millionaires. I don't know. Millionaires. I feel like I could frig around and find out that these are just like... Uh, King Oscars in a different box. Like it's their Canadian branch or something. Eating the millionaires after winning Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Dude, I can't... Why don't I think of things like that, you know? Wow. Those are actually pretty... Pretty cute. Camera's too low, though. Oh, man. Why am I messing around at that degree? I'll just do this. They do look nice. And I like that I can see some, like, little spices and things. Slam, slam one of these babies. They have a good smell, too. So far, I'm, I'm pleasantly surprised. Tell you what, that's perfectly acceptable. Lightly smoked. Fish. She is very small. Petite poisson. Bristling sardines, olive oil, sunflower oil, black olives, red pepper, garlic powder, Italian seasoning. So there's a good amount of flavor in this tin. Pretty solid. And they don't really advertise it. I thought they were just going to be normal. It doesn't say on the box, like, oh, they're super... Super spicy. Super Italian. These are so good. They're a little bit mushier than a King Oscar. A little bit of a looser flesh. But these are perfectly fine, dude. And they have a lot of flavor. A ton of flavor. This is one of those cases where the graphic design of the box makes me go, oh, this is going to suck. Because, I mean, let's be real. Pretty subpar 
graphic design. Not very interesting, not eye-catching. Just kind of super uh, straight and narrow. Hey, we got fish in a box. Come buy it, you know? And I don't know why, but that... I mean, that's real. That that psychologically affects the way, the way I think it's going to be. But this outshines its graphic design. Yeah, these are these are kind of banging ass, to be honest with you. That fish do be looking dapper. Yeah, but Mr. Peanut already has that vibe on lock. You can't just be the Mr. Peanut of fish, you know. This is a this is a winner, big ol' olive on this one. Get a little pepper piece, and you're having a party. Get a little bit of oil on your. Play map. Step aside, string bean. Who's bro? Who's bro? That tin look dank. What? Yeah, that was great. That was a, uh, that was a treat. I'm into it. I'm into millionaires. Saw some dropped fr frames earlier, but who cares? Yeah, it looks like I got 385 dropped frames, if you want to know the exact number. But I don't care. Do you care? I don't care. Okay, jabronis. I uh, I don't have any women on on my mind. Actually, I do have one, cause I used her earlier. But uh, I'm I'm here for some uh, don't think Olympics. I'm here for some some hints. Olympics, I'm gonna tell you right now, does nothing for me. I do not know Olympians. And I'm surprised that anyone does. I didn't know people people got down with Olympians like that. Had no clue. Where's my mouse? This is one of those moments where I'm like, why isn't the game capture better? There we go. Today. Oh, I love this game without music. Today, I believe we we could get most of the way through the castle, if not all the way through the castle. Although I don't remember where we are and I need my bearings. Oh, no, we're about a third of the way through. Maybe we won't get through the whole castle. It's a pretty big castle. Girls just want to have fun. Oh, girls just to wanna have fun. What's her name? Something like uh, Cindy Lauper. <laughs> Cindy Lauper. Shout out to Vegan Bob. You know who sang Barracuda? Heart. But I don't know who the names are of the people in Heart. 
I see how it works now. He knocks me out of commission so you can strut around in your fancy number one shirt. Heart is banned. Yeah. Oh, cool. Look what I just found. If you shoot the statue in the eyeball, you get a spinel. Pretty neat. Pretty sneaky, sis. I'll take a grenade. I'll take a grenade any day, bitch. I'm gonna start calling everything bitch like Jesse Pinkman. Give me some ammo, bitch. <laughs> I think pretty simply we just go this way. Oh boy. Is this where I came from? This is that stupid room I just came from. UFC fighter turned actress. Molly Holmes. Holly Holmes. That's who beat. Holly Holmes. Beat that one guy fighter lady who was amazing for a long time. I can't remember her name. Did you get some of the English royalty or that famous nun? I got some of the English royalty. I don't know if I got a famous nun. Uh-oh, Ashley. You're right. I'm fine. Leave me alone. Ashley, wait. <gasps> Let me open a seltzer water YouTube. Oh, this is awesome. I think this means I don't have to have Ashley with me for a while. Ashley. What's going on? <gasps> Rhonda Rousey. Don't worry, Holly Holmes beat I'm Rhonda Rousey. Eighty-two percent, dude. I'm kind of on fire. She drove for NASCAR and was a spokesperson for GoDaddy. I know who you're talking about, um, but that was that's a little that's a little back in the day for me to remember her name. Honigan, what happened? The transmission got cut off. <laughs> Salazar. How dates Aaron Rodgers? Exactly like we already got T Swift. You want you telling everyone any unnecessary information? Where's Ashley? Ah. His eyeballs are not level. Traps. We'll make sure we find her. Don't you worry about her. Oh, yeah. Scammed a bunch of people with the blood sample. Watch that movie. Exercise down in the sewer. Thanks. That's weird company. Weird lady. I can't remember her name though. I look forward to our next encounter in another life. British Prime Minister. Dude. Rule number three, homie. No whack ass boomer shit. <laughs> Voice actress for Ashley and RE4. I bet you I know it. Or did know it, but um, names just don't stick with me. That's the problem. That's why this is such a challenge. That's why this has taken us two weeks. Why does it seem like I'm supposed to... Oh, check. Here we go. Ashley's on the other side. I'd better find another route quick. That lady that's friends with apes. Uh... Damn, I, I I know who I know who all these people are you're talking about. I just don't have the name at the tip of my, my the tip of my nip. At the teeth at the tip of the tongue and the teeth of the lips. The tip of the lips. The tip of the tongue and the teeth and the lips. 
She starred in the movie called Speed and was married to Jesse James. I don't know who Jesse James is. Should I know who that is? Oh, geez. Oh, geez. Did y'all hear them footsteps? Can you scroll up on the list so we can get a refresher? Scarlett Johansson, Amy Adams, Michelle Obama, Oprah Winfrey, Rachel Ray, Britney Spears, Christina Aguilera, Amanda Bynes, Jeanette McCurdy, Miranda Cosgrove, Lana Rhodes, Aubrey Plaza. Oops. Damn it, that would have been cool if I didn't. <laughs> Mindy calling. Come on. Oh, jeez, I can't do this. Kamala Harris, AOC, M uh, Marjorie Taylor Greene, Nancy Pelosi, Queen Lizzie, Marie Antoinette, Asa Akira, Riley Reed, Belle Delphine, Ela Klein, Prue Leith, Mary Berry, Lady Gaga, Pink, Beyonce, Taylor Swift, Hillary Clinton, Ghislaine Maxwell, Mary J. Blige, Missy Elliott. All right, I, I'm, I'm, I'm done with this. I'm done with this. <laughs> Noticing a pattern. Played the invisible girl in Fantastic Four. Bro, we can't do Madonna. You guys already ruined Madonna. Madonna is banned. You already said her, her name in the chat. Sandra. That girl was friends with Harvey Weinstein. Oh. Got him with that stealth kick. Great, I'm gonna blow all my ammo on these losers. These invisible dick bags. Yikes. All right, I guess we have to use our shotgun on this dickhead. Otherwise, I'm just gonna keep missing. Dude, what? There better not be a billion of these because in the remake, there's like a billion of them, but they die in one hit, so it doesn't matter. Jesse James is a tattoo artist. Listen, I'll take your word for it. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. Bro, this is kind of brutal. I can't uh, see where they are. All right, that worked out. Handled it. The way they're giving me uh, gems makes me think there's no, there's, uh, there aren't going to be that many. Because that'd be too much gas. That girl that was friends with Har Heart, yeah, we, we got her. That's Jizz Lane, right? Or no. What do you mean friends with Harvey Weinstein? My beans fell. I got too many beans. The one whose butt leaked online. We already did Kim Kardashian. <laughs> and I don't know. I don't know who you're talking about. Oh, great. There's too many of these things, man. I just, I just complained about how, or I just pointed out that there probably aren't that many. Now I'm saying there's too many. Man, I hate how quickly they jump away. 
Get off me, dickhead. Making me use all my resources. The girl in Harry... Oh, J.K. Rowling. I can do that. Oh, no. I already did her, I think. Control F. Row. No, I didn't do that already. Outstanding. Ooh, Emma. Emma Watson? Is that her name? From Harry Potter? And then there's Emma Stone. That's pretty good. That was a pretty good, uh, a pretty good run. I'm happy with that. Cruising. And we just got kind of like the greatest pull. Combine these three herbs here. Speaking of great poles, I think we're going to do the Terminator box next. Yeah, level up my health. Rapper that sang Barbie World. Would you classify that as a rapper? Barbie song? I hear you. I hear you, but I don't see you. Ultra old lady that shouldn't be on the Supreme Court. Oh, yeah. The dearly departed. What was her name? Diane Feinstein. Why do I know that? I shouldn't know that. I'm, I don't, I don't want to know that information. That's too deep into the political world for me to know. Louis Lewis's memo. There are some parasites that have the ability to control their hosts. Studying these parasites specifically might reveal some clues as to how the powers of the Las Plagas work and perhaps provide more insight on the victims of the Las Plagas, the Las Granados. Oops. Where am I? I'm all turned around. All these doors are too damn rusty. Why is this is this is weird. You're getting into boomer territory. I know, bro. You gotta check rule three. Oh, now we're cooking. Now we're cooking. Key treasures. Butterfly lamp. Look at that beautiful butterfly lamp with all its eyes set and in indentations. That's going to be how we upgrade, boys. It looks like a drainage valve. Spider-Man Dune actress. Zendaya. Zendaya. One name. I love that about her. She's like Prince. Drain the water? Yeah, drain the water. She also sang a song called Anaconda. Dude that won Decathon but is now a lady. We... I think I know who you're talking about, and I think we did that person. when we were going through the Kardashian family. 
Don't even think about it. Oh, come on. That's so not fair. They jumped too quick. Bro, chill. Homie, chill. I've kind of had it with these things. Singer. No, you can't say four letters. That's too, that's too close. Has a residency in Vegas and refuses to retire. Pink? We did pink. ABBA? I don't know. I'm just thinking what's four letters. I dare ya. Did you get that lady with the big tits that has an amusement park? She's dead though. Um, I don't know what lady has big tits in an amusement park. No idea. I've never heard of that. A big tit lady amusement park. I don't know if that's real. Governor Mass. No, we did Dolly Parton. She's not dead. I don't think so, anyway. Jolene. I don't know the govern. No, she's not dead. She's totally kicking, bro. Governor, I don't know the governor of Massachusetts. No idea. Why did I just drain water? What what did that achieve? She made the worst music video. Oh, uh, Rebecca Black. She went on to to open for Marilyn Manson. She's actually having like a wicked heyday right now. Rebecca Black. She's kind of killing it. I haven't listened to her music, but she was on, like, a, she was on H3, and she was doing the rounds, you know. People seem to like her now. You know any Twitch chicks? I know Amaranth, and I know Cutie Cinderella. And Pokimane. Oh, man, we're flying now. Ruh. Becca Black. Amaranth. Amaranth owns a, a chain of gas stations. Cinderella. Pokimane. Flying. I didn't even know he was there for sure. I just heard it. I heard it and I said, just shoot. She was the girlfriend of the six million dollar man. Well, first you have to tell me who the six million dollar man is. Cause that seems like uh, a rule of three violation there, pal. Oh, this looks fun. The lady in the government that's too good at trading. We got her. She used to be married to, to Johnny Depp. We got Amber Heard. That was pretty easy. That was a that was a baby mode uh, puzzle there. A hundred people is tough, and there's people that have done this in like one sitting in like ten minutes. This is like the this is what the real IQ test should be. 
Can you recall humans? Is just all it needs to be. What is your ability to recall names? Member of the royal family who died in a car crash. Ah, Diana. Bryn. Man, what a random set of names. Rebecca Black, Amaranth, Princess Diana. Here we go. Gonna kill some dudes. Ayesta. What? Man, that is gnarly how it's coming out of his head like that. Let's switch to a simple, simpler weapon. Ooh, love it. You love to see the one hit head pop. Sex tape with Tommy Lee. I don't know. I th I'm just gonna say Paris Hilton because that's what came to mind. I don't think that's accurate. Ooh, uh, <laughs> here's one. Here's a boomer one for you. <laughs> Does Snooky count anymore as a prominent figure? I mean, I guess she could have a resurgence and people would know who she was, so that's good enough for me. She was on Baymatch and played Hide the Salami with her husband. Who's Snooky from, uh... From, uh... Jersey Shore. What's up with this? This is just meat? That's a big sword. You can't even wield that sword. There he is. There's my guy. Welcome. There's my homie. Let's sell him some Don't gems. Things on sale. What are you selling? Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Thank you. Is that all? Spindle. Old? <laughs> Thank you. Is that all? Velvet blue. <laughs> Thank you. I'm gonna keep my cat's eyes. Might do something with those. <laughs> Thank you. Illuminados pendant. Uh, I'll. <laughs> Thank you. We are sure to be able to tune up some stuff. Nope. Riot gun. Why can't I pick it? Because I have it fully. Is maybe I have it fully upgraded so far. Thank you. Is that all? <laughs> is that? <laughs> is, <laughs> is, <laughs> thank you. Come all right, on. we just we just hit the rifle with some upgrades this time around. No big deal. Just our least used weapon. Not super helpful. Oh, I hear mum mumbering, mumblings. Nueve, nueve. Castalian, Castalian memo. For many years, the Salazar family has served as the Castalians of this castle. Castalians? Castalians? I don't know. However, not everything is bright for my ancestry has a dark past. Long ago, there was once a religious group that had deep roots in this region. 
I like to read things like uh, like an 80s anime narrator that's like recapping the last episode. Long ago, there once was a religious group that had deep roots in this region called the Los Illuminados. Unjustly, however, the first Castellan of this castle took away their rights and powers. Married to a really famous guy who invented something with computers. No clue. Absolutely no clue. As a follower of the religion, and as the eighth Castellan, I feel that it is my duty as well and my responsibility to atone for that sin. I knew the best way to atone for the sin was to give the power back to those who once took it away from the Los Illuminados. I don't even know. I'm I'm not even understanding this. Melinda Gates. I probably... If I sat on that a minute, I, I might have picked that one up. Maybe not, though. That's pretty. That was pretty deep in my my locker, my brain locker. It's just that easy. I'm about to take some hits. I can smell it. Oh, nothing better than the one hit pop. Matano. I'm uh I'm scared. I feel vulnerable. Enough mumbling. She's an actress in Swordfish. Total babe. Is that, is that the same person that's in Beetlejuice? Because I haven't gotten her yet. I couldn't think of her name. I'm pretty sure that's the same person. Short hair, Beetlejuice. Right? No? I've never actually seen Swordfish. I only know the... the the picture of it, of like the, the VHS cover where they're all sitting in like a car and it's black and white or whatever. I actually have no clue what goes on in Swordfish. No idea. There are boobies. Played Wednesday Adams. Oh, um... Wait, are you telling me that the girl that played Wednesday originally is not the same girl that was in the original Beetlejuice? No, the no, of course not, because that's a different person altogether. She played Storm in X-Men. I just know Oh, Halle Berry. Yeah, we'll do Halle Berry. Halle Berry was Swordfish? I don't know, bro. I might be like way, way in the, in the, um, I might be a little too lost here. Speaking of lost. Oh, this is a good one. Cause what a weird name this is. Evangeline Lilly. Modern Wednesday Adams. Modern Wednesday uh, Olivia Rodrigo. That's not her name. But that is a person, right? I actually have to Google that. Olivia. Yeah, that's a person. That's not her, but that is a person. And I'm gonna take it. We are getting to a hundred today. <laughs> we're, in a, we're in the final stretch.
Oh, this guy has face armor. Oh, he slid. He slid out of my knife range. I feel like it's gonna go down. Oh, the, uh... The Ladies of the View. I think we did, we did Whoopi already. The Osbournes have been ruined. Can't do with the Osbournes. And I don't know, I, the rest, as far as I know, the rest of them are nobodies, I don't know. Dude, enough with the Nueve. <laughs> Y'all gotta chill. <laughs> Jabronis are chiller than that, guys. Come on. <laughs> you don't know them personally. They're just doing their jobs. They're supposed to be annoying. That's their whole their whole shtick. Short-haired blonde lady on TV. Well, when you say TV, what do you mean? I hate to be that millennial. What, what should I play here? I hate to be that millennial that brags about this, but... I haven't had cable since I moved out of my mommy's house, okay? So what the hell do you mean by on TV? You gotta be specific. Which streaming service are you talking about? It's very important. Because other than that, my TV is just blank fuzz, you know? It's got nothing else going on for it. Nueve, nueve. Come on, you dingus. You loser ass. The lesbian is too much and gives too much info. You can't, you can't do that, man. You can't call someone the lesbian. There's, that's not a, that, that's not chill, bro. It's not, it's locked. You're talking about Ellen and I already got Ellen. Ellen's already on the list. I am going to butt blast this guy. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Coward. Absolute coward. I feel like I, I had every opportunity to kill this guy like four times and I just haven't. I, I didn't know he was gonna run, basically. Stop running. Come on. What? What are you talking about? Famous for smoking a cig in a cig holder in certain movies. Corella DeVille. This girl acted as her own twin. Um, I think we already have... Damn, dude. Minigun out of a fountain. Yeah, I don't know what's up with that. iCarly, we already ran through iCarly. Used to be on Nickelodeon, was on a series called Younger. This girl, uh, what's her name? I feel like we did her. You're talking about the red hair girl. Um, Lindsay, Lindsay Lohan, right? Who's on the view? 
All right, what do I use here for this? This is so stupid. Fountain minigun. Like, what is the... Why did they make this? What is the tactical purpose of, of installing a minigun here? There we go. That worked. Brennan's hint on the view. Brennan... Too far up. <laughs> All right, let's go get the key. Actress in Ace Ventura who is also in Friends. Um, I love that you started that off with Ace Ventura. That's pretty cool of you because I believe most people would, would have began with actress from Friends who also happened to be in Ace Ventura. So you did that a cool way. Um, this way. Babe from Office Space. Jennifer Aniston. That's who we were trying to remember when we were doing Friends. That is, oh man, my spelling. That is egregious. I'm gonna leave it, but that's that's rough. That is something else. She used to have her own show on ABC. Trump was in a feud with her. Oh, Rosie. Rosie O'Donnell. Oh my goodness. Rosie O'Donnell. I don't know. I don't know how to spell. Dude, this is fucking horrible. Scare boy chick. Avril. Levine. Bro, we only need four more. Rosie ain't even it? Okay. So what's ABC? I don't know what shows were on ABC. That's the thing. You really lose me when you talk about TV networks. How do I get out of here, man? This place is whack. An actually attractive blonde lady. Who, who are you to say Rosie O'Donnell isn't attractive, bro? Everybody is somebody's type. And you know what? Rosie O'Donnell is a beautiful woman <laughs> who someone loves. There we go. We got back. The babe from Transformers, Megan. I love how you say everyone's the babe. <laughs> the babe from this and that. Uh, the babe from Transformers is Megan something. Megan Fox? Is that it? Megan Fox. We got Megan Fox. Damn. Thought we had something. Man, who's the actually attractive blonde lady from ABC? From the ABC network. We have to know who is the actually attractive lady. Wow, that's awesome. It's badass. Three Jesuses? Oh. What? That's just lazy game design. Actress on Seinfeld. Nice, bro. Julia. Let me just make sure we're not already. I'm typing Dre. Okay, we're good. Julia. Louis Dreyfus. I don't know how to pronounce it. I think it's the weirdest name ever made. But I'm gonna I'm gonna run with it. Oh, it's not lazy game design. 
The sacrifice of six lives shall make the true path. Okay. So... Oh, I, okay. I have to flip it until there's only six people dying. There we go. That was easy. Send a link to, to the stream chat. I think uh, I think Google filters them out. But you can do the Discord. Because I have to like approve links individually. And if I turn that off, then I suddenly get a bunch of scammers like trying to get my comments flooded with uh, random like scams. So. Velvet Blue. Everybody knows what Velvet Blue is. Oh, this is where it goes down, bro. What a pleasant surprise. I believe I'm about to be assaulted by all angles. Not you, Mr. If you don't need me, then get off my back, old man. <gasps> Did you say old man, Mr. Kennedy? It might come as a surprise. But I'm only 20 years old. So you're just like all the others? A puppet of the parasites? Surely you don't think I'm the same as those diminutive ganados. The parasites, las plagas, are slaves to my will. I have absolute control. Well, I really don't give a damn. Rain or shine, you're going down. Get rid of our American friend. Let's do this. Let's blast them. Oh, great. They all have sides. I'm just going to headshot them all. Wow, this is going way too well. That went way too well. That was entirely too successful. Wow, I haven't missed a shot. I'm nervous. Oh, there's another one. I'm kind of out of control right now. I'm kind of cracked. That was basically a 360. It wasn't a no-scope, but... Oh! He's suddenly, like, looking right at me. No. I didn't miss a single shot. I didn't miss one shot. Come on, loser. Wow. And here, okay. Yikes, bro. Where are they? RPGs. Resident Evil 4 always kind of reminded me of House of the Dead for some reason. It is pretty, uh... It's similar. Resident Evil's a little more like... They're not actually zombies, you know what I mean? Like, it's a different... A different kind of... Kind of weirdness. Oh, they're right above me, that's why. Or are they not above me? Where are they?
I don't know where they at. Where are them RPG zombies at? It's gonna run in circles. Wait, did they just fire one round and then run? I think they were behind that. Recently started watching Fallout, never played the games, pretty good show. Dude, honestly, it's so good. And if you like it, the the like pl playing Fallout 4 will be a lot of fun for you. Cause it's it's probably the most like Fallout 4 than any of the games, but it's um it's so good. It's crazy good. And I expected the worst. Ain't got that streaming service. Yeah, we uh we're we're a little bit of a shopaholic family. So we have we have Amazon by default, so it was no big deal. Weren't the early Fallout games turn based? Yeah. Way back. That was like way, way back. That's boomer shit. Former Alaskan governor who ran for vice president. Um Sarah Palin. Let's not let the last three be as lame as failed politicians. Nailing Palin. You get that chick that keeps doing climate protests? Um, I don't know her name. I know who you speak of, but I don't remember her name. Bro, I, just, I can't believe I sniped every one of them. Ron Burgundy's co-host. We tried that already. I can't remember her. I don't know if I ever knew her name. J.O., welcome in. Happy Wednesday. It is Wednesday, my dudes. Why am I down here again? Veronica Corningstone isn't a real person. I'm kind of um, not understanding how to get out of here. It says that the Oh, here we go. Here we go. No, this is where I just was. It says the security system's active. I have to deactivate it first. Okay, elaborate. How do I do so? Spirit bomb me your woman naming energy. Oh. I am not digesting well right now. Singer for all I want for Christmas is you. Is that Mariah Carey? Because I believe that's on the list already, fortunately. Yeah, that's Mariah Carey. Masculine female WWE wrestler that is now deceased. It's a weird, it's a weird line of words. That's a first time sentence. Bro, this is not intuitive. What do I do? Where is there a button or object to interact with? Ultra famous lady leading army of people. Hmm. I'm in the just shoot everything phase of of uh, confusion here. John Lennon's wife. Can I be real with you? The Beatles is... 
I always I always take flack for this take, but Beatles sucks. And I don't know nothing about them because as soon as I heard them, I said, damn, this sucks. I don't care about this. You know, I'm not going to learn all the in and outs of the Beatles because this sucks. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> boomer ass take. No, dude, liking the Beatles is a boomer ass take. I'm British and I think they're overrated. Thank you, bro. Bro, I'm munching on some Nuri. Lynx is 43. Welcome in. I love that you named yourself after your router. That is very cool. I don't know if we can be friends anymore. <laughs> yeah, I always get a bad reaction whenever I share my Beatle opinion. But I can't help it. It's just the way I think. I'm lost. I'm just stuck in this room. I don't know what to do. Pre-boomers said the Beatles were the devil, and that's you. No, dude. It's just coming back around. Uh, history is cyclical, you know? I'm gonna throw a grenade at this painting. <laughs> that did nothing. I have no fucking idea what to do. No clue. Absolutely no idea. I believe in the cyclical nature of things. I do too, man. I don't know what to do. Oh my God, there's a button. The Beatles aren't the devil. They're just lame and boring and old. That's, that's how I feel for the most part. For, for the, no, okay. That's how I that's how I feel partially. Is that they're lame and boring and old. For the most part, I just think that the argument a lot of people make are, oh, without the Beatles, you wouldn't have any uh modern rock music or whatever. You wouldn't have any punk music or long haired dudes. And I'm like, yeah, fine. That's great. Doesn't mean they're good. I don't care. They started, they they, they made things change, you know? They started a, a movement. Doesn't mean they're good. I I agree that they that they kind of were like the first like major boy band and you know, they didn't conform to social norms and that that kind of became uh rock punk history as we know it, but they suck. I'm sorry. It's not fun. It's not fun to listen to. It's tinny. It's very abrasive. It's it just and it just keeps going. They it's like the whole song is the, is just a chorus. It just keeps going. Now I'll give it to you. I'll give it to you. Um, Eleanor Rigby is pretty good. I like Ele Eleanor Rigby. Imagine the Beatles are just like the Backstreet Boys. They kind of, I mean, they they were. They were the B-Boys of the day. I could give you 10 better Beatles songs. I feel the same way about Monty Python. I like uh, Monty Python and the Holy Grail for nostalgic reasons, but Rewatching it is is tough. I, I I'm pretty sure I tried to show it to my wife because she had never seen it, and it was one of those things where you're like, "Wait a minute, am I wrong to to like this? This actually might not be great." There's definitely scene. Oh, okay, there's definitely scenes that are great, but it's but there they weren't really great at uh pacing. There's long stretches where you're just like, get this over with. First lady, I saw that. I saw you delete that comment. First lady whose husband got his face blown off during a parade. That's rough. 
That's a rough way to put it, homie. <laughs> That's gnarly. I'm to here with these guys. How do I extend the bridge? Oh, that's what the button was. I think. Did I hit it? Dude, why is this area so puzzly, yet so unintuitive? How do I access now this stupid middle chest? Okay. I found it. I take it back. I, I found it. It was, it was not that difficult. I got the goat. I got the goat and I'm ready to proceed. Think historical. This lady led an army and is somewhat mythical. Uh, a mythical lady that led an army. Let me just remind you, I got a Florida education, all right? Kinda starts similar to your web name. <coughs> Same letter. <laughs> you're, you're giving me everything and I got nothing. You're giving me all the clues in the world. Woman with a famous cooking show on Food Network. I already got Rachel Ray. French? Question mark? Disney star turned singer. Oh, man. There's only one of those. That narrows it down. Last name, same as the beer and the symptom, Simpsons. Ordinarily, I would say that was a little bit too close to giving it away. But I'm gonna take it because I was trying to remember that name last time. One of my favorite chefs. Who's Rachel McAdams? Do I already have that? Who's Rachel McAdams? Is that a person? Rachel? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we want Rachel McAdams on the list. Yeah. Let me just copy that. I don't, I don't even want to try to type that out. There we go. We only need one more. I should have like a, should have like some music or something. <laughs> but I absolutely don't. I didn't think we would get it, to be honest with you. Regina George from Mean Girls, yeah. And she was, uh, what was her name, Elfie? From, uh... Man, watching me try to recall names of things must be the best content in the world. Uh, not Game of Thrones, Hunger Games, right? You can do a quick dupe check too with Excel. Yeah, I sometimes I Google how to do that at work. Because I'll have like a list of part numbers I need to look for dupes on, but... Watch this. Eat... Stun grenade, birds. And why do you do that? Because sometimes they drop rubies. Is it two clicks on sheets too? Because if it's two clicks on sheets, you better give me that information. You better give me that tech. That strategy. 
female cast member of Mythbusters. Oh. Oh, we got there. Hang on. Hang on. Pause this. Music. Celebration. This doesn't feel like a celebration. No, these suck. See, this is what I do when I try to find music for something. I just play all these terrible songs until something speaks to me, and sometimes it takes me like all night and I don't even find something. This'll, this'll do. Carrie? Byron exclamation marks make it huge <laughs> it's like the least hype celebration of all time play the penis song Hell yeah. Woo! <laughs> oh, that was foul. <laughs> oh, jabronis. We did it. We did it. We did it. Now let's get out of this fucking castle. <laughs> that was entirely too successful. <laughs> it just came to me, you know? It was it was a spur of the moment. Oh, I need Ashley to get in here. That's where the broken butterfly is. That's actually a secret item. I don't need that. I don't care about that. <laughs> Dude, so often am I like, man, I wish I had the time to like make TikToks out of my like stream moments. That would be one for sure. That was like that TikTok meme or the guy farts into the Walmart PA system. <laughs> I don't think I saw that, but that sounds pretty good. This area sucks. Mr. Kennedy. So, do you like my garden? I see you've managed to work in a little of your twisted taste here, too. <laughs> Sagacious as I am, even I get lost here sometimes. Even if it takes your whole life, you'll never get out. Do you know that no one dies without a cause? You will satisfy the stomachs of my cute pets. Now, what a weird thing to say. Me, I have to tie up a few loose ends, like chasing down a couple of rats. Two rats? If one's Lewis, who's the other? I'm trying to find this fart intruder besides me? <laughs> <laughs> this this uh, fart in the Walmart PA system. I think I got it. Select two objects that are the same shape. Confirm. And now I need this. Where is that? Oh no. No, don't move that around. How do I get... Here it is. Okay. Move this over here. Continue as a guest. Here we go. I got it. Oh, that's gnarly. I honestly, I don't think that's real. I feel like I've heard that just sounds like 
I, as someone who's who does music production, that just sounds like you added reverb. Yeah, I don't think that's real. That's not the actual reverb of the space. That's 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 fake reverb. Plus, like you gotta know the button. You have to like type something in. You don't just pick it up and talk. You know? Is this the one? Let's try. Let's try YouTube. Guy farts into supermarket speaker. Oh, this, there's a lot. There's too many of these. You notice how it's the same sound effect? Yeah. It's the same sound effect. The, they, they have been lying to you, I'm afraid. <laughs> Why are Walmarts even still open? Because they uh, know how to position themselves in uh, communities that uh, end up having to rely on them, you know? Yeah, so uh, I'm sorry, but I think you got scammed. Yeah, they're all hitting the same note. <laughs> that should be a red flag. Now, how do I get rid of this? This was supposed to be temporary, a temporary window. So I don't have a button that's assigned to it. Can I go in this room to save the game, please? Of course not. Imagine someone just watching a big ass montage of that. Yeah, that was that was a pretty short montage. So I don't feel too weird about it. But if I had watched maybe like an hour long. I would feel weird about myself, yeah. This area blows. I hate this area so much. This is just jump scare. Well, not even jump scares, but it's like attacks you can't prevent. Yeah, here they come already. Like, you can't do anything about that. Once it, once it starts whipping you, it's over. Stupid. Stupid asshole. If I worked at Walmart and saw this video, I'm never putting my face to that phone again. Congrats on the hundred women. Thank you so much. I couldn't have done it without the jabronis by my side every step of the way. Except for the ones that were just in my Pornhub search history. Those ones were easy and I did them all by myself. That's probably why they always have uh, like Whenever you see, like, the phone at a department store, there's, like, sanitary wipes and hand sanitizer. It's like a whole station, you know? Fire extinguisher, everything you need to deal with that situation. Oh, great. Gra oh, I'm going to town on these dickweeds. Oh... You never stood a chance. Another one coming. I'm more of a target guy anyway, dude. If you don't have a Starbucks built in, fuck off, you know? The only time we go to Walmart is if we already went to Target and they didn't they were like out of what we wanted. Here we go. We got the left half of the moon stone. Bro, four at once, really? Losers. Loser ass dog dicks. Ooh. Jackal. Oh, you got target? You bougie. Bro, it's a... 
It's a target, all right, but it's... I'm going to be real. Not a great target. Any plans for Sunday? I was thinking a uh, tourney bracket. I would find a weird tourney bracket on... Uh, there's this... I don't know. There's I forget what it's called, but there's this website that does tourney brackets. And they're pretty funny. And then I have a haul, a new haul to start. And then I'll probably find some kind of interactive game that we can play now that we have no uh, latency issue. So should be cool. Should be a cool Sunday. I don't know yet though. I, uh, I'm really bad at planning more than like a couple days ahead. I'll put a thousand dollars on Yukon Huskies, please. I don't even know what that means. Is that a sport? A sport game? That, that sports ball? Yeah, this is definitely better. I, I, I hope it doesn't... I, I'm going to watch the VOD, and I hope it doesn't affect the quality too much, because I do, I do think that VOD... VODs are important. VOD quality is important. Personally, I'm a VOD boy. I don't watch anything live. Bro. But uh, if if it doesn't really affect anything, I, f I feel like we it's just it's just winner winner all the way. Like, what's the downside? I don't know. Like, why is it? Why is latency nor on like slow mode by default? I have no idea. There was one moment when you, when the game went weird. Yeah. That was probably one of the times where I was opening and closing Millionaire, though. Because I'm telling you, that game completely takes over. Yeah. 1080p the whole time. Yeah. I mean, honestly, seems like... Seems no different. It just seems strictly better, so... We might have we just kind of nailed it. And it's funny that it took 50 streams. Although Wubby, uh, Wubby's audio sucked for like six years until I emailed him about it. So at least I didn't wait six years to figure it out. I'm about to be out of ammo and health. Kneel before VOD. That's kind of how I feel. Although, as a streamer myself, the live experience is, is definitely growing on me. <laughs> Imagine I just didn't... I just recorded. I just was never live. I strictly recorded alone. That wouldn't be very fun to watch either. I'm VOD game because I fall asleep sometimes. Yeah. That's the thing about VOD gang is you get to pause and go back to your life every now and then if you need to, you know? That's a pretty important benefit. That's a pretty good bonus. So I already got the stupid thing from here, I think. Nope, I'm just lost. I'm just fully lost. Oh, I bet it's the middle thing. I bet it's the middle thing. Let's go back to the middle thing. I don't remember how to get to it. It's a maze. Oh, there it is. If I go this way... It would be kind of weird if you were recording. You stop, reverb fart into the mic, and continue on as if nothing happened. Yeah. Yeah, you make a good point. It's definitely this staircase, so how the fuck do I get to it? Here we go. 
Always go left unless you have to go right. That's that's wise. It's there. That's where it is. But how do I get it? I go. All right, I got it. I memorized it. <laughs> I got, honestly, I keep telling Fish Lady, I'm like, dude, you got to learn how to edit so you can help me make, uh, you can help me make, like, TikToks of, like, stream clips. Because a hundred women celebration reverb fart, I feel like would get some jabronis in the seats, you know? That would bring some new viewers in from TikTok. And the right kind of viewer, too. Like the, like the perfect kind of jabroni. The one we really want, you know what I'm saying? The perfect jabroni, bro. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Top quality content. <laughs> I don't know if you caught that one. I don't, I don't feel like that one was fully, uh, fully, fully placed. <laughs> Uh, all right, I gotta chill. I'm a little bit, I'm, let's bring it down a notch. We're getting a little weird with it. <laughs> None of that lowest common denominator jabroni. That's what I'm saying, dude. We need those tried and true jabronis. <laughs> the ones that see a reverb fart and go, that's where I wanna be. <laughs> Do you enjoy reverb farts? Well, welcome aboard. That's so gross though. Just, <laughs> just thinking about like, let me put this microphone right back in my face. That was awful. That whole, that whole maze section. It was just too much for me. I feel like I ran in a lot of circles there. A little brief moment of respite while we meet Ada Wong. Put your hands where I can see them. Sorry, but following a lady's lead just isn't my style. So okay. corny. Now. Huh. Action movie. I feel like I'm watching the tuxedo. Starring Jackie Chan and bit of advice try using who was that girl works better for close encounters he sounds like snake there Leon long time no see hey. go back in time and tell young jabroni that so someday you'll be reverb farting live on the <laughs> internet and people will love it <laughs> you working with Wesker yeah I see you've been doing your homework why Ada what's it to you why are you here? Why'd you show up like this? <laughs> Jennifer Love Hewitt. See you around. That's a woman. Ada. Where's she been? I feel like she was the hotness for like three years in the movie scene. And now she's just gone. We're going to get to the bottom of that. I'm too curious. What happened to Jennifer Love Hewitt? It's right there. She has been working at People since 2023 and interned with The Brand in 2022. That seems like a step down. What 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 happened before that? Wow, you open up a web page on any on anything. You are assaulted. Assaulted. So she had kids. 
and she took it she took a break she took it easy yeah same thing Hillary Duff did they're uh, ads so bad there needs to be a law I understand ads to a degree but if it's if the user experience is completely decimated it's like slow down dude I know what you did last summer yeah I never seen that but yeah she was like super famous for that did I didn't I just save I'll just do it again when I smoke a pipe very rare nowadays I always thought pointing with it was cool it's same with pointing with glasses, something a professor would do. Oh yeah, why don't you try pointing with a vape? <laughs> why don't you point with a vape, homie? Tell me how cool you feel then. Welcome! There seems to be a female intruder among us. We believe she's connected with Sarah. We also believe that she was the one who removed the egg injected into Sarah before it hatched. She may have had him retrieve the sample before the American agent's arrival. Did you smoke it with a turtleneck on? Welcome. Got some rare things on sale, stranger. What are you buying? Ooh, we got the black Is tail upgrade. <laughs> Is that all? <laughs> Thank we are basically you. invincible now. Is that all? <laughs> Not enough cash. Stra Not enough cash. Come back anytime. What was that movie with Dana Carvey dressed as a turtle? Master of Disguise. I bring that up in my house at least twice a month, I think. Because turtles are, uh, are animals that kids like to talk about frequently. And every time they talk about turtles, I go, Am I not turtly enough for the turtle club? Turtle, turtle. I think that turtle scene was filmed on 9-11. That's a nice little bit of trivia. A desert to cherish or remaining years. A dessert to cherish, or I don't know. Oh, this is like a puzzle. Bread begins the meal of life. One last drink. And the bottle breaks, returning us to dust from whence we came. Maybe it's not a puzzle. Maybe it's just random bullshit. Here we go. Unlock a, a way back. Yeah. Although I'm pretty much, I, I'm kind of like, I feel like I have everything I need. I could use, I could use an RPG. It's advisable to use an RPG on uh, the like right hand man assassin guy. He's pretty not. Oh, oh, Cobra. I didn't see it coming. What do we gotta what do we do next now that we named a hundred women? We need another thing. Name a hundred something else. Maybe we'll do like name a hundred child actors. That could be fun. 
That's probably even worse. That's probably uh, that's probably far harder. Name a hundred. We don't want to do name a hundred children. That's weird. A hundred notable men. See, that's easy. There's so many more notable men. And I know that sounds wrong to say. But I, I asked my wife to do a hundred men and she was banging it out. You know what? I'm talking a big game. I have to just put my, my mouth where my, where my butt is or whatever, whatever they say. So we named a hundred women. Now we're going to name a hundred men. Uh, which window was that? There we go. Cool. And I'm going to start with Patrick Swayze. Then I'm going to move on to Sylvester Stallone. Then I'm going to move on to Keanu Reeves. Uh, lead singer of Aerosmith. Hard mode. Hard mode. Hear me out. Name a hundred men. None of them problematic. We might have lost on Sylvester Stallone already. And he's done. New Roadhouse movie star. Um, is that JGL? That's not JGL. But that is a man. That's Bubble Boy. Isn't that Tom Hanks' son? Yoko Ono's dead husband? Bro, get out of here with that. <laughs> Alright, I'll do it. John Lennon. Uh I mean that's a good amount of dudes. Right off the bit right off the gate we got six. Can't believe we didn't get Yoko. I I I think I would have gotten that if I if I didn't go on my tangent. I would have gotten it otherwise. I'm still saying the lead singer of Aerosmith. I said nobody problematic. Nobody that marries 15-year-olds. The anti-Beatles rant. We remember. We will always remember. Oh, shit! Bro! Are you kidding me? That was so psycho. And I wasn't paying attention, so it was extra psycho. That was wild. I just got so trapped. Like, that was like such a trap. So what do I do? How do I, how do I avoid that? I just don't go near the treasure? Oh, you're, there's like no way, no way around it. All right, I know what to do though. I'm gonna spam. Oh, yeah. I'm too good. Ow. 
Actually, though, I'm cracked. Oh! We blasting. Open road says six million dollar man. Is that uh Are you talking about like a wrestler? A wrestler comes to mind when you say the six million dollar man. He was the host of the best major network late night show. Dude, enough with these dickheads. What's going on here? Um, Hulk Hogan, he's problematic. I guess we lost the problematic race. Hulk Hogan, uh, Edward Norton. Abraham Lincoln played the Joker. Uh, uh, damn. There's like four people that that works for Ghostbusters. Damn, remembering names is hard, dude. We stepped into the wind. He had a gun. I had a grin. You think this story's over, but it's ready to begin. We like eight people in. Yeah, I know, man. Played in a knight's tale. Heath. Heath Ledger. Abraham Lincoln, boomer shit. Name the guy we were joking about for Dune earlier. Muadib. Muadib. Um, Timothy. Timothy. Timothy Chamberlain. I have absolutely no how, no idea how to spell his name. Not even gonna really give it a shot. The other guy. Oh, um, dude, how, like, we were just saying it, and now it's gone. How does that make any sense? How do I not remember? Timothy Charlemagne. Charlemagne the God. Oh. Don't even get me started. You God? Ghost face killer? Oh wait, I actually did that in two lines. The Rizza? The Jizza? Old dirty bastard? In spec the uh, deck the Rizza the Jizza Old Dirty Bastard Inspect the Deck uh, Raekwon the Chef Method Man Red Man 60 Second Assassin Ah. Uh, Amber Heard shit on his bed. Uh, 
Damn, why does this happen? It's like it was so clear in my head. Best friends with Chewbacca. I mean, that's obvious. Everybody knows that. So this should be proof that, like, it's just hard to recall in the names in the moment. He's going through the lyrics of that one song. Yeah, you caught me. The Rizza, the Jizza, old dirty bastard, Inspector Deck, Raekwon the Chef, you god. I'm pretty sure I, I got most of them. Yeah. Yeah, I think I got most of them there. I might have missed one or two. But that's a lot of that's a lot of Wu-Tang members to hit in one go. Bro, what's up with this door and how do I uh open it? It's absolutely not reacting at all. Oh, you know what? I bet there's something I have to shoot outside. That would make sense. Sports people? Not a chance. I bet I can do... I bet I can do some really rudimentary sports people. Babe Ruth? That's rudimentary as hell. Um... Dan Marino. Laces out, Dan. Who played Ace Ventura? Famous hockey player. I know who you're alluding to. Wayne. This is so much easier than the women. Michael Jordan. Um, Finkel is Einhorn. The Office cast. Rain Wilson. John. Krasinski. Yeah, I, I, I'll get Ace. I'll get Ace Ventura, for sure. It's not coming up right now. I don't know how how to get out of this cage, guys. Oh, there's two doors. Why is there two doors? Is that is that does that mean something? Why is there two doors? Was I supposed to like let one of them let me out or something? Are we just stuck here? How do I get out? I'm Googling it. RE4. 2005 how do I get out first result how do you get out of the cage oh you just need a stronger gun Guess I should have tried that, you know? I guess that should have came to mind easier. But, you know, I just... I did so well killing all those guys. Like like that, like it was nothing. That it didn't occur to me that I just had to blast my way out. So anyways, I started blasting. Is that Frank Reynolds? That's not Frank Reynolds. David Bowie. Charlie Day. Frank. Frank. So anyway, I started blasting. Frank something. 
His name, is his name not Frank in real life? I don't remember, dude. I simply don't remember. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm coming in blasting. I'm not even screwing around with these red robe dickweeds. So anyways, I started blasting. Oh, great. We got the spiders. Mandel bomb. Jerry Seinfeld. Conan O'Brien. Adolf Hitler. Talk about problematic, you know? Know what I'm saying? I wonder if I try to blast this door, if that will do anything for me. Oh, killed the guy behind the door. That's something. I'll take it. Too easy. I'm being forced to watch Disney Wish. We we watched some of it the other day, and I don't I don't know if I understand um, the negativity. Maybe I missed. Maybe I didn't get to the part where it where it starts to suck. But I thought it was not terrible. We were having a good time with it. Gonna watch this till my daughter falls asleep. I know the, I know the vibe, bro. Take it easy. Nueve. The dude? Oh, that's, um... Oh! I don't know if I know that, actually. I might not have that information buried away. Bro. I'm gonna die. A fruit a few presidents seem like easy bait, yeah. That's what I'm saying, like there's just more dudes. There's more prominent dudes, unfortunately. You know, like no one's gonna sit here and know. A bunch of WNBA players. It's just the unfortunate truth. But I know Charles Barkley. I know Shaq. Who's the Shaq of the WNBA play of the WNBA world? And how do we get her exposure? Here we go. They just, they're giving it to me. They really do be that easy. Oh wait, they're not dead.
Ooh, an RPG. I needed that. Sardine reviewer? Yeah. I suppose he is prominent. I could probably name one WNBA player, and it's that chick who was just in a tournament. Well, that's one more than me, dude. I gotta take the rocket launcher. I got to. Absolutely got to. So we got some rearranging to do. How do you do this again? How do you do this? Shift? No. I swear I had. Oh, yeah, I was using the controller before. Here we go. Broke a scoring record? Man. Sounds like she needs notoriety. Or deserves it anyway. Let's get her her own space jam. What are we waiting for? This is my favorite part of every game, trying to make things fit in your backpack or whatever. Maybe if I do this, I'll have better luck. Let's go. How big is this stupid thing? Caitlin Clark. It was all over the news on cable TV. We can eat an herb. No one pays attention to it. They don't make much money playing. It's a vicious cycle. Yeah. It's too bad. It's pretty it's pretty rough. I don't I don't like that. Yeah. I'm being I'm being obtuse, intentionally obtuse about the TV thing. For just for the meme of it. I don't know if I can fit this without throwing out half my shit. Yeah, I gotta throw half my shit. I don't need jackal ammo. I don't need three of these. I don't need three of these. I don't need magnum ammo. Oh, this is exhausting. And this is the biggest box I can get, too. Rip off. I think if I get this this way... Here we go. Now we're on to something. Now I can move this here. I think we got it. I think we got it. Put the controller down. Stupid useless controller. Yes! We got there. Now we can carry that for the rest of the game. Until, uh, until we fight the guy that, uh, the assassin dude who's, like, impossible to kill otherwise. Or just very difficult, at least. Oh! I forgot I had 
grenades equipped. So that was a, another little quick, another little quick uh, inventory clearance. It's getting too hot in here. Basements need AC. Normalize AC being included in the basement. We made it. We made it to the next save spot. And I think this is our last one for the day. Oh, it's so hot in here. Oh, jabronis. I never can figure out how to exit the game. I believe... There we go. Pirate of the Caribbean whose bed was pooped on. Johnny Depp. Listen, you can shit on my bed any day. Know what I'm saying? Johnny Depp. Midnight snack, anyone? Do I have plates? Do I have additional plates? I don't think I do, but I do have an additional tin. I do have one more tin for the road, jabronis. We can use this Swiffer. Oh, cool, it's invisible. It's a, it's a green Swiffer, Swiffer thing. And it's fully invisible. This is awesome. Um, excuse me? This is awesome? Bro, watch this. Watch this. Where is it? C-cam. Filters. Is that not amazing? I have a green screen play mat that does not work this well. This is another Brennan special. Wild mackerel. This is so cool. Sardines floating in space. It's mackerel floating in space. Boneless, skinless, lemon, peppercorn, mackerel floating in space. It's a little texturized. Maybe you'll try this side. Oh, this side's even less. This is even better. This is what I was trying to achieve with the stupid green screen uh, mouse pad, but it just didn't work at all. Oh, that smells good. I don't know why, but that smells good. Deans in space. No, that's no good. Get rid of that. Jabronis, thank you for hanging out with me today. We had a hell of a time. We tested out low latency. We slammed two Brennan Deans. We got most of the way through the castle, I think. Pretty good. Not terrible. We named a hundred women. We farted on the microphone two times. And we named 33 men. All in all, a pretty successful Wednesday, I would say. And I gotta say, I'm impressed with Canadian grocery store tinned fish. It ain't bad at all. Because there's some tinned fish in my local grocery stores that I wouldn't touch with a flamethrower. But so far, Canada's two for two. Yeah, this tastes great. It's subtle lemoniness and just the right amount of black pepper. 
And a lot of times I really don't like mackerel because it has like the brutaliest fishy fishiness. Like way too fishy. That's not happening here. That's not a concern here whatsoever. Oh yeah, the fish head deans were not good. So so uh Canada is two for three, which is pretty good. Yeah, I'm gonna keep this Swiffer pad on deck. For sure. Adam West. Christo Fur Nolan. Jack Black. See, it just keeps coming to me. Dwayne The Rock. Johnson, Eddie Vetter, uh, I forgot to mention, I watched that as VOD gang, the fish heads were wild, yeah, dude, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't wish that tin on my worst enemy, to be honest. It was crazy. This, however, is outstanding. Just click enter. What? Fred Armisen. What? Um, Bill Burr, Joe Rogan, this is way faster. We're going to get to 50. Let's do 50 and then we'll do 50 more next, uh, we'll do 50 more on Sunday. We need eight more. Uh, Dimitri Martin. Uh, look around my room for clues. Hmm. I'm coming up blank. <clears throat> Let me just eat some mackerel and think about it. Hmm. Jackman, Ryan Reynolds, five more, Acid Rock, that's not descriptive enough for me. Well, we got a problem, boys. We had a child throw up. So we're we're going to save these 5 for next week. I mean for Sunday. And we're going straight to the outro. Thank you, Jabronis, for hanging on a Wednesday. It was a great time. And I'll see you Sunday for a super Low latency. Super, uh, what's the word? Interactive stream? It's gonna be a yap fest. No gaming, probably. Just yap vibes and epic deans, bro. And, uh, I really appreciate you guys hanging out with me. Do on to other jabronis. As you would do on to you. Uh, to them. 
and uh, try anything 10 times. Jabroni out. Let's go clean up some puke. What do you